I'm in one of the leading hotels in Kuala Lumpur where the Petrona Sintium drivers are working out in a gym facility in preparation for the next Super Thai Q round. Such camaraderie the teammates have, not only do they race together, they work out together as well. So let's find out how these guys manage to keep fit. An offset to the All Japan Touring Car Championship that ran from 1994 to 1998, the Petronas Sintium team is a four-time champion and the team to beat. Helmed by people who are the best in the business, team principal David Wong, team manager Gen Suzuki, race director Tetsuo Suzuki, the man behind the infamous Nissan Skyline, driver trainer Andy Poon, technical engineer Nicholas Thomason, and the rest of the pit crew has made this team a force to be reckoned with at every round. Farik Haruman is a Johor-born Malaysian driver who is no stranger to Malaysia's racing fraternity. Having seen the potential in his driving skills, David Wong scouted Farik personally and together with Masataka Yanagida, they made their debut in the Super Taikyu series in 2007. Hi. How are you? Good, good, good. Sorry to disturb. Yeah, no problem, no problem. <laughs> okay, so I just want to find out about your training regime, what do you do on a daily basis and how do you stay fit? Uh, normally, because I have my own business back at home which is uh, doing iron works and everything, so I lifting a lot of the irons at home. And then uh, for the gyms, normally I go like three times a week, uh, but not not as uh, hard as other people do because we are. For me myself, I just keep on my fitness and everything, and just do a light, very light exercise. I see. Okay, so you know, us being Malaysians, we love our rice. Yes. We have to eat rice almost every day. Yeah. So, do you have to give that up, or you can still eat whatever you want? Uh, I just pretty much eat whatever I want uh, during daytime. For dinner, for lunch, I will have a heavy lunch. But then for dinner, I just have something light, easy to grab. That is for off season, but during racing season, yeah. is it the same? Yeah, to me, it's it's same all the time, all the year. No, there's no difference between off season and ongoing season. Racing in an endurance series, mm -hmm. what you need is focus. Mm -hmm. How do you maintain your focus during a race? Normally, for a racing driver, we need to keep on driving every time. So that's that is our routine. If we are not racing on that weekend, we need to find something that. Mm -hmm really uh, connect us to the racing so I mean focus uh, is always come naturally is coming to me once I put my helmets on I just focus on what I'm doing I see mm -hmm. okay I'll see you again okay, the <laughs> Ui Fei Hong, a product of the Petronas Formula Experience program is in his rookie season for the 2011 Super Taikyu Endurance Series he brings in his own flavour of driving style, having four years of experience in the go-kart world finals. So Faye, tell me about your training regime. How do you keep yourself physically and mentally fit before the start of the season? Well, I definitely have to have a lot of cardio training to keep my stamina up. That's a really important factor when I'm racing. And I do a little bit of mental training as well. like playing a simulator and then just trying to imagine a race situation what I would do during that situation. That's interesting. Yeah. So do you find it necessary to add other sports and other activities so that your body can react to the training at its optimum level? Yeah, that's true. I do a lot of um, mostly futsal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and um, I had an interval training where I do weights and cardio at the same time, so get the most out of it. Okay, last question. Focus is paramount to an endurance race such as this. So how do you manage to maintain your focus sitting in a car that can go up to 40 degrees Celsius? Well, you know, it's the outcome of the race that I focus on and just thinking of being in front of the pack at the end of the race, that's mm. what keeps me going all the time. So you don't care about the heat, you don't feel anything? Yeah, I don't feel anything while I'm driving. Okay. Good luck in the upcoming race. All right, thank all you. Dominic Ang, another Petronas Formula Experience alumni, has been racing go-karts competitively since he was 12. Making a stint in the Formula BMW Pacific in both 2008 and 2009, Dominic made his debut at the Super Taikyu Endurance Series in 2011. Sorry to interrupt. Yeah, no problem. So I just want to ask you a couple of questions. Like, how is your training regime like? You know, how do you keep yourself mentally and physically fit before a race? 
Well, normally I do it almost every week, about cycling, cardio, about three, four times a week, plus rock climbing and gym, about two, three times a week, yeah. Oh my gosh, oh yeah, I've seen you before rock climbing, yeah. right? Yeah. So, that would be your ultimate favourite sport, rock climbing? Yeah, because in the gym it's a bit boring doing weights, so rock climbing you have a challenge to climb higher and higher. Yeah, so it'll be quite fun, yeah. I see, do you usually work out with your teammates or with friends? Normally in gym, no, but rock climbing, I work out with my previous teammate, Melvin. Yeah, okay. so mostly with Melvin. Yeah. So while working out, what do you normally concentrate on and why? Uh, normally I concentrate on getting the maximum results, so, so I can get the best result from every workout, so I can get the full potential. Yeah. That's why I want normally aim it. I yeah. see. So uh, what kind of mental exercises do you do before a race? Uh, normally, I get to learn the tracks and maybe watch some uh, race videos from the previous races. Then maybe some onboard videos to learn the track. Because it's in my first time in Japan as well, so all the tracks are quite new to me. So I do mostly all that, yeah. Very nice. Very well prepared. Well done. Yeah, so wish you all the best for the next um, race. Good luck. Thanks. Number one, yeah? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> for sure. Uh, ichi. Ichi. Nobuteru Taniguchi is hailed as the undisputed D1 Drift King. One of Japan's racing idols, Taniguchi started his motorsports career riding minibikes, then gradually progressed to four wheels. He is the most experienced one in the team and has been racing in the series since 2001. Okay, Taniguchi, tell me about your fitness regime and how do you keep yourself mentally and physically fit before the start of a season? Uh, training, I'm not doing training. No training? No. No training. Really? So how do you keep fit? Or is it the food you eat? Is it all mental? Mental is a Japanese word. Makezugirai. Makezukitai? Makezugirai. I hope win. Oh, okay. Only... Your spirit? Yes, spirits. Only spirits. I see. So it's all willpower. Your mind says you will win, hence you win, but you don't go to the gym. That's amazing. So what do you think is the most important aspect for a driver in order to succeed in a Super Taikyu race? Hardworking or discipline or, you know, mind power? What's the most important? Good teammate, good machine, good team, good sponsor. Good sponsor. Good package, eh? Okay. So it's not just one, it's the whole package that's important. Okay, very nice. And I hear that you play golf leisurely also. So how does that help in your fitness and your driving? Or it's just for fun? Golf, mental training, very good. For golf? Mm. Oh, very Thank good. you very much. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> Thank you very much. One of the pioneer drivers of the Petrona Sintim team, Masataka Yanagida is no stranger to the Super Taikyu series. Having partnered Farik Hairuman in the team's debut at the Super Taikyu, Ma, as he is known among his peers, started off his career go-karting in 1993. Hi, Ma! Hi! <laughs> How are you doing? Good! Yeah, good! And you? Uh, I'm good. Are you, am I interrupting? Do you want to carry on doing this? You can go on if you want to. Okay. <laughs> Okay, oh, tell me about your fitness regime. Are you in the gym every day? Not every day, mm -hmm. but uh, normally I do a uh, gym twice a week. Mm -hmm. mm. And uh, I like uh, sports. Oh. I play baseball, golf, mm -hmm. swimming, every sport I like. Oh, golf also. Your teammate Taniguchi plays golf also. Are yes. you better or Taniguchi is better? Taniguchi is better. Really? Much, much better. But, uh, <laughs> he almost a professional golf almost. player. Yes. And you are far from professional? Very far. <laughs> okay, very <laughs> And I heard that um, you tried yoga a long time ago. So yoga is part of your fitness regime. How has that helped you in your fitness and in your driving? Yoga? Mm -hmm. Stretch. Okay. It's a... Uh, very important okay. for the driving, mm -hmm. but difficult, difficult. To, uh, yoga for me, very stiff. You're very <laughs> stiff. Yes. So yoga helps you be more flexible, and stretch yes. more. Yes, I do stretch before the driving. Mm -hmm. This is uh, very important. Oh. And besides working out, your diet also is important. So what do you normally eat for breakfast, lunch and dinner? 
during a race season? Uh, before race, uh, I have to eat uh, pasta and rice and for, the, for the energy, oh. for the race. I okay. think uh, very good for endurance race. Oh, okay. uh, rice is uh, for power. Oh. Mm. Yeah, you look very fit. So I'm not going to disturb you, carry on with your exercise. I'll leave you to your workout, okay? So thank you very much, Ma. Thank you. <laughs> See you. Good luck. See you. Tatsuya Kataoka, or formerly known as TK, completes the Petrona Sintium team for the 2011 season. Japanese racing teams noticed him when he dominated the local go-kart scene back in 1992. Kataoka has been with the team since 2008. Hi, TK! Hi! <laughs> Are you okay? <laughs> you need yeah, some okay, help? I'm okay. Okay, you're a strong man. Yeah, uh, domo, domo. How are you doing? Domo, Good? Yeah, good. Yeah, very nice. Okay, so tell me about your fitness regime. What do you do every day and how do you keep yourself physically and mentally fit? Uh, but I'm not training so every day. Okay. Yeah, but uh, so before season, so I'm training so main menus, so no power. So just, uh, let's say, I don't know, so jogging, oh, swimming, okay. so, so... To get your stamina. Yeah, stamina, yeah. What is your favorite form of exercise and how does that help in your driving? I like to train, so swimming. Okay. So, because good, so stamina. Mm -hmm. So, uh, mental, mentality, so if no stamina, uh, very difficult, so... Concentrate. For an endurance series such as these, the main element that you must have is focus. Mm -hmm. So how do you maintain your focus during the race? Yes, so enduro race, so if maximum so focus, very difficult. So if 24 hours, but so no focus, very dangerous. I mean, so usually, so my mind is very so uh, with like a uh, simple, so no angry, no sad, no fun. So long time, just keep, wow. keep my so mind control. Just re so relax, very difficult to say. So, but maybe I think so. I have many experience. Yeah, because when you start off, mm. a lot of things is in your mind. You're stressed. Yeah. You're scared. So how do you push that away? Yeah, push out. Okay. Then just, so it's very simple. Yeah. Oh, that's very interesting. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. And good luck for your race. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Racing is not just about getting in a car and flooring the throttle round and round the circuit. Competitive driving is a discipline, an art that is hard to master. It takes not only a healthy body, but a sound mind to gauge what lies ahead. So folks, not all of us can be race car drivers, but we can lead a healthy lifestyle like one. I'm Julie Woon, signing off for now.